Hey guys, Bobby here. Welcome to Nitro RCX. Today I'm going to show you some of our newest and latest cars, particularly our 124 scale cars. We have them in a short course version, a mini monster truck version. Some of you may recognize what this looks like. It is our Mad Beast, but shrunken down into a micro machine. And we have a rally car, looks similar to our Tacon car, and they're all 124 scale. We took them out to Santa Fe Springs and had a lot of fun with them. Out of all of them, I would say the Micro Mad Beast probably performed the best outdoors. It has the higher ground clearance, the bigger tires. The short course truck is kind of a good in-between. You have the best of both worlds. You have that ground clearance and you have slightly larger diameter tires. When you get to the rally car, it has lower ground clearance, a bigger body, and it's good for, you know, rally driving. You don't want to be driving this in tall grass because it'll get stuck. And of course, they're 124 scale. So you do want to drive them in conditions that are scale. If you drive it in tall grass, obviously it's not going to go anywhere. But they're great for taking to the park with your kids, with your buddies, setting up a little racetrack in your front yard or your backyard and having a lot of fun. These 124 scale microcars are ready to run out the box. You will need four AA batteries for the 2.4 gigahertz transmitters that, that it comes with. And you're pretty much ready to go. They come with nickel metal hydrate batteries and chargers. They run for about six to eight minutes of runtime, which is pretty good on a small little battery of this size. And you get that 2.4 gigahertz transfer, which means you get better range and you can run a bunch of them at the same time without having to worry about interference. The transmitter is a pretty nifty little pistol grip transmitter, nice and small and compact size, just like the cars. You have a foam trimmer on the steering wheel that gives you good grip on the steering wheel and the spring returns back to center real nicely. On the car itself, it is brushed, driven, electric. You have coil springs front and back, independent suspension, and it glides pretty smoothly over the terrain. As you can see, the cars are a bit dirty. We ran them a lot at the dam. We took it on different terrains, grass, gravel, over little rocks, and even uh, really loose dirt. And they did pretty well, pretty durable. We even jumped them a couple times, and they held up well. You got metal dog bones front and rear that transmit power to the wheels and those hold up well, nothing snapped. It handled the dirt very well, especially the mini monster truck. This one amazed us the most. It probably performed the best out of the three. If you wanna drive outdoors in gravel or dust and sand, you definitely want to pick up the mini monster truck. If you're doing some short course running or some carpet running, the little cars will do fine. They handle, they actually handle a little bit better, a little more agile, if you will. Oh no, these 124 scale cars are pretty fun. Of course, they're not as fast or as powerful as your 110 scale cars, but if you want something to drive around or something for younger children to play with, these cars are the ticket. If you want more detailed specs and pictures, head on over to nitrorcx.com. The link is below. Be sure to subscribe to us if you want to stay tuned for our latest and newest products. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll catch you guys later.